Hi guys, David Aaron Dicker here and today I'm going to be teaching you how you can mount DVDs and CDs using a bit of software called Virtual CD10. So what this program does is it enables you to trick the computer into actually thinking that it's got CDs or DVDs inserted into the DVD drive when it actually hasn't. It works off of virtual DVD drives so these are the virtual DVD drives itself this is the DVD drive or the one and only DVD drive that I have actually installed into the computer itself but what this enables you to do is you can write images itself from the CDs or the DVDs and then make backups and then obviously have them backups on a hard drive and then mount the images onto the computer basically it saves you a lot of messing around like changing disks and everything so what it is that we're going to do is I'm going to show you how to mount a disk into the actual bit of software itself and then you'll be able to see exactly what I'm talking about. So if I double click on drives you can see all my virtual drives and then my physical drive, the actual DVD drive that I have, have actually installed into the computer. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you just how to install a game. So let's go into the game master copies and then say Assassin's Creed so this will be the image itself 15 gigabyte so I know that that's the image I'll drag it into virtual images so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drag it onto one of the images from the drives and then I'll drag it straight over and then it's come up autoplay so it thinks that I've actually just put the CD into the computer itself and then I'm ready to install, install and run so if I go into my computer I'll show you exactly what I mean so there it is itself it says that it's 15 gigabyte and it says that it obviously it is a DVD itself so if I go on to auto run exe it's going to ask me if I want to install the game so here it comes up here now so obviously because I have actually got the game installed it's asking me if I want to play it so if I do click on play it'll be able to take me in obviously and whatever but what you what you do is you can use this to install software as well like if say for instance you've got a graphics card and it comes with a CD itself, an, an actual like driver CD. I would advise always copying all of your software. The only reason why I would say copy your software is because it's handy to have a backup. So is obviously you, if you lose it, it is actually still backed up on your on your computer's hard drive. So as if you do lose it, then you can just install them drive like like drivers again to to make make sure you can get your devices working properly. But I hope you enjoyed watching this, guys. I'm going to leave all the details of Virtual CD10 in the description so as if you want you can you can try this software out. I hope you enjoyed watching this video guys. Please stay tuned for more videos to come soon. Please remember to subscribe, comment, like and share. Thanks for watching guys.